Good evening, Brad S. here. Just wanted to give you a little update on some of the things I've been working on. This is the original stovetop cell that IB Pointless developed. It's several weeks old now and it's, it's been going pretty good. It's made of 20 Mule Team Borax, Salt Substitute, and McCormick's Alum. IB Pointless showed that this should also use uh, aluminum foil on the bottom and I did not do this. Uh, but mine's been running several weeks pretty well. It did drop off voltage a little bit from when it was first made, so the aluminum probably is pretty important. I want to show you the cell that I added to, and this is my new cell I'm calling a hybrid. Notice I'm using a lead motor steel wire pancake coil jewel thief on this. This is a wonderful little little circuit. And notice how much brighter that light is. And this is with the pot at the lowest setting. I'm going to turn this up just a little bit. Notice that's, that's, that's getting pretty bright there. It's kind of hard to get it set perfect. But that's, that's showing up pretty well. Let me show you what I did a little bit different on this cell. Um, I did, I did use the foil in the bottom, but then I added zinc oxide and antimony. This is, this is the antimony here, and I, I just filed a few, a small amount in, into the mix and added just a little bit of zinc oxide. I went ahead and cooked it the way I'd be pointless shows to cook his stove, stovetop cell. And then I put a little white glue on top just, just to seal it. And you can see it's, it's running very well. And uh, here's a little update on some of the other cells I've, I've still got going. This is one of the very first cells that uh, I encased in plastic. And you can see it, it's, it's still going. And this, this cell is over two months old. Uh, this is one of the very first ones. This is alum only with a magnesium anode and a copper cathode. There's my original cement battery. <laughs> it's been going four or five months now and hadn't skipped a beat. This is uh, another set of cells here. These are, I hope you can see that, three little half inch copper caps that I put together. They've been running that white LED for about three weeks now, non-stop. I'm pretty happy with that. And then, of course, there's, there's my, uh, my water batteries. Those things have been running that red LED for over a year now. But this new cell here, I, I think this is pretty exciting. Uh, we'll see if it holds up, but I'm, I'm very happy with it so far. Thank you for watching.